along the nail and welcome to the Amuna Project. We here at the Amuna Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to guidance and uh, advice <clears throat> and inspiration and kiruv, drawing people close to God. And sometimes uh, one of the greatest kindnesses, the greatest chesed a person can do is, is to reach over that gap between an observant person and a non-observant uh, person, and to not be uh, to not be ju to not judge them or to be holier than thou. And one of the greatest examples uh, of this was the Klausenberger Rebbe, who, after the war, was uh, helping Jews wherever he could. And uh, an American official once brought it to the Klausenberger Rebbe's attention that there were some um, Jewish girls, some Hungarian Jewish girls at a DP camp, a dis displaced persons camp. And in the tumult after the war and losing everybody, they were starting to behave in a way that was not proper for Jewish girls to act. Immediately, the, the Klausenberger Rebbe went to this camp and um, sought out uh, these girls, spoke to them, uh, talked to them, uh, consoled them, listened to their stories, their losses in the Holocaust. All their families were wiped out and encouraging them to come with them. He was setting up uh, a school especially for, for, uh, for young girls uh, who, were, uh, who were left after the war with nothing to give them a sense of uh, purpose, a sense of uh, Jewish identity, it turns out that these girls were all, before the war, were all religious. They were all from, these were Orthodox girls, and the, 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 the disaster of the Holocaust just shattered their lives, but the Klausenberger Rebbe was able to, to bring them back and, uh, and set them up in, the, in this school. And uh, they all appreciated and uh, loved him. And probably the greatest uh, testimony to this is that uh, these young girls referred to the Klausenberger Rebbe as Tati, as father, because he was a spiritual uh, father to them when uh, none of these girls had any fathers left. Um, he was non-judgmental. He didn't care about these girls' past. He didn't care about the present. He was only concerned with their future. And may we all show this kind of uh, uh, this kind of love, this attitude, uh, this generosity of spirit um, when dealing with others. We're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please watch. Uh, I hope you find them uh, inspirational. And until next time, on behalf of the Immunal Project, I'm Daniil, and thank you too much.